What's up guys? Welcome to another Sunday video of how to make a voice bot part 2. So now in our last one I showed you how to add multiple responses to the voice bot so it doesn't just give you one answer when you ask it one thing. So now in this video we're going to teach it how to tell us the time. But we're not going to actually teach it, we're going to pretty much hard code it. So what we're going to want to do first is go in your grammar.txt these two files should be in your C directory, which I sh told you in the first episode, because some people had some confusion on that one. So right here, we're gonna go grammar. We're gonna add a new line, and that's gonna be what time is it? Okay, we're gonna save that, and in our responses, oops, we're going to add a response, but we're gonna use a star to mark that we are doing a complicated argument, and we're gonna do time our time. Okay, and we can X out of these two, and we can start coding. So, what we're going to do right here, we're going to go in here and we're going to make an if statement, and we're pretty much going to copy this right here, but we're going to change this to a star. Okay, let's put an else on there, and we can just move this up here. Okay, now in here, so we're going to check if that text file has that star, and we're going to do another if statement in here, and we're going to do if result dot contains, and we're going to put our keyword in there, which is time. So this is what our argument for time is going to be. Now right here, we're going to say your date time dot now dot to string and let's organize how it says it let's put an at sign in here let's do hh so we're going to say our hour first we're going to just put a space and we're going to do our minute and tt so that should be the am or pm so now we have this all written let's test it 